Breaking news on a story we've been covering all week. President-elect Donald Trump's sentencing in the New York hush money case was indefinitely postponed this morning, Friday, November 22nd. And, you know, I have been asking all along how you can indefinitely postpone a sentencing when we are guaranteed in our Constitution and Bill of Rights a speedy trial. Our Anglo-Saxon system of jurisprudence actually deserves better than this. We've seen it really take a hit under the prosecution or lack of prosecution and speedy trials for J6 prisoners and all of the weaponization of government and um, law lawfare against President Trump. This isn't the way we were meant to be governed. It's not the Constitution the founders left us. And there are further developments in the unrelenting media firestorm ginned up against Matt Gates. Just before Gates dropped his bid for attorney general, Senator Josh Hawley had this to say to his Senate colleagues about Trump's cabinet pick. Well, I think the word ought to be, Jesse, that every single one of these nominees needs to have a confirmation hearing as quickly as possible. My plan is to support all of them. And I would just say to my Senate colleagues, listen, let these guys testify. Give them a shot. I know some of these Senate, some of these Senate GOP folks are saying, oh, I've got concerns. That's what a hearing is for. Don't go out and bash these people until you've at least allowed them to make their case. Yeah, making the case, uh, these people should be brought up for confirmation because they're the people that have been chosen by former, or I should say, President-elect Trump. President-elect Trump is the one who gets to choose his cabinet. And the advice and consent process is where you test the mettle of these individuals and see if they're worthy of joining the cabinet.